Hey everybody, welcome back. I'm glad you wandered out to the Digital Hermitage again. I'm Hiccup the Hermit and we're playing some more Valheim today. We didn't get to play any at all after the last episode, so we're picking up right where we left off last time. Built our little hut out there with the smelter and the charcoal kiln and probably gonna uh, try to feed that a little more copper today if we can. Uh, that'd be great uh, to pump that out. And I wanna make the copper knife. Uh, we did. Yeah, we managed to make Forge, and the only thing we can make so far is a Copper Knife, which I'm really interested in, because the knife served us so well in the last episode, and I'm just really digging the knife. It uh, leaves me with plenty of stamina to run around, dodge, uh, escape, mostly, because on single player, I feel like I'm just getting overwhelmed a lot. Uh, if I had better internet, because where I live on the mountain, there is no internet at all. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll try and load some Copper and, and stuff into that later. And that should be pretty fun. Uh, it might just be a lot of running back and forth between the dark, the black forest and here. Uh, what I wanted to do today, uh, is probably not gonna happen. Uh, we were going to, let's pull up the map here. So my true plan uh, yesterday was to try and find another area in the water out here, but I wanna keep it in the dark forest because we really wanna live in the dark forest. So we'd love to like take our trail and maybe wrap it here and then come down this way to some ocean sea part you know like this we just need it to connect to the open water and uh, what I was gonna do is build a little dock and maybe sail our raft out there because that side of the island pull up the map again is closer to the elder Ugh, I say closer that's pretty far away like we haven't even traveled that much distance on our island so that's gonna be a really exciting adventure to try to get out there and visit or fight and challenge the elder not sure that we're ready for it yet we might want some better gear like I said we got to make the copper knife we'll get to it anyway yeah I wanted to make a little port a little dock something out here in the dark forest we may turn that into our new like main hermitage too because uh I mean that forest is so cool anyway uh, so before we get into that, though, because I have no materials to do that, so they may, that that build may happen a little later today off camera or something, and we'll montage it in the next video or something. Maybe. I'm not sure, guys. Uh, like I said, I'm still experimenting a lot, so try not to show off any of my, 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 my really lackadaisical just kind of like piddling around builds because, like, yeah, a lot of this was thrown up really quick. Uh, but I'd like to make something really cool. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Uh, right now, I want to check out some cool things that we collected in the last episode that I'm still kind of unsure about. I'm um, going to go ahead and put some stuff away real quick. All right. Bone. That's pretty cool. You know, we may be able to level up a few things with the bone. I feel like bone was something we needed to level up a lot of things. Yes, here they are. Seeds. Guys, we have seeds. First of all, carrots. I mean, I like carrots. I wish it was potatoes. I'm a big potato fan. I know, I know you're thinking, oh, potato. Like that, yeah, but potatoes are great. I love potatoes, any form. I'll eat them right out of the damn ground. I love potatoes. All right, so how do we use these? Super curious as to what is going to happen here. All right, six. Use carrot seeds on what? On this plant. Did, this, I, did I not... Okay, apparently we can't plant anything still. Ugh. Okay, I'm not going to waste time on that then. Let's, I guess, let's put those away. I don't know. Something eventually has got to give us the ability to start farming and planting things. But I guess we'll figure that out another day. That's not happening. So let's uh, pack extremely light. And I guess instead we'll go and try to, yeah, we'll try to find a location. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll go exploring a little more and uh, maybe try and. Oh, come on. Like the. There we go. Yeah, go exploring a little more and try to find. Uh, try and find an outpost. And barring that, we'll just uh, mine some copper and come back. I don't know. 
seems like it's going to be a pretty chill episode, guys, but let's get into it. Oh, it's raining. All right, I'm just going to let this stuff cook, and then we're going to start adventuring. We'll, uh... Yeah, we'll probably follow the shoreline uh, all the way back to the Black Forest. We'll do a little hunting, a little gathering along the way, but I think we're just going to follow the shoreline. It'll, uh... Hopefully reveal a little bit more all along the map here, right? Yeah, hopefully it'll reveal a little bit more. We'll clean up our map a little bit. And uh, I don't know, maybe we'll run into some boar and pick some berries along the way. Oh man, guys, look at this ring of stones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine, twelve. Well, man, that's still pretty cool. I kind of dig that, it's kind of creepy. It reminds me of a uh, old Stephen King uh, short story called, uh, I think it's just called N. Is it N? I think it's just called N, like the letter N. Oh, look at this clearing. Oh, and guys, look, we found it. There's the Black Forest, the start of it. Man, this would be a cool spot for a little outpost. Look at these trees. Now this, now this place is awesome. I kept saying in the last video, we need to live out here, and it's so true. I'm so gonna live out here somewhere. Whoa, are those different kinds of mushrooms? No, those look like the red, normal red mushrooms, but that's awesome. Oh, they're like growing under the rock. How do I get mushrooms to grow? Guys. Ow. Hey. I'm tired of your stuff, man. Whoa. Wait a minute. Look at this. Is this a dungeon? No. Yes. Oh, wow. That's a big one. All right, let's mark this one on the map so we can come back to it. Oh, I would, I would go in here and explore. I really would. I kind of want to, but, um, you know, our track record with dungeons is just not good. Uh, are we anywhere close to finding, like, where we wanted to be? Oh, I named it M. Man, we are actually pretty close. I'm just going to rename this real quick. I think I spelled that right. Yeah, we'll come back to this. We'll come back to this one. That's a really big one. I'm kind of excited for that one. I remember Hugin saying, he, saying something about uh, tin on the shoreline of the of the Black Forest too. Now, what is that? Uh... I feel cold. Yeah. Well, I'm wet. We're outside. Silly gray dwarves. Uh oh, broke my torch. How dare you, how dare! Yeah, wow, they didn't like the fire. Can I make another torch? Ah, <gasps> no, because we're carrying no wood. Uh, boar trophy and deer trophy. I mean, I don't, well, I don't know. We, we might want some of those back. Uh, eh, no, no, I don't. Is this just me, or does that look like another cave entrance? Holy hell! We do have a bow. I guess it's time for another battle with a badass troll. Except... Danger, danger, because he's closing in on us. Oh my gosh, he's quick. Hey, that's a copper deposit. And it is the entrance to a, a dungeon or a cave. Look at that. I knew it. Guys, I would not mind if the episode became about hunting trolls and getting some of that new troll armor because something tells me that that might let us go live on the mountain. <laughs> Thank you, trees and scenery. <laughs> the only thing keeping me alive right now. Oh, I'm really surprised that did not hit me, actually. We got this. We got this. More troll stuff. 
what is he doing? He's so mad. Ah. Yeah, sit down, buddy. Oh, did we pick it all up? Troll hide. Alright, let's mark this one. On the map, as also unexplored. We got a couple of little unexplored dungeons. The troll... Oh my gosh, it's a troll cave. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. This is different. Crap, guys. We can't actually fight fight a troll, can we? I mean, running around and shooting at it with the bow is one thing, but stabbing at it with a knife is... Uh... Wow, we just walked right behind him. He has no clue we're here, guys. Although this troll definitely has a... A frickin' tree trunk. I think we're gonna do this. Or not, you know? We're not gonna do this. Wow. That hurt. Can we lure him outside? You should come out after us, big guy. If we can sneak up on him and get him with the dagger again, that seems to do a good bit of damage. Nope, he sees us. Oh, actually, the knife does more damage with a backstab, so here's this. We're gonna try and take a hit on the shield. Nope. Sneaky, sneaky. Don't turn around. Uh. Yeah, maybe we can get a shot or two. Oh, yeah. Wow. All right, we're going back in. Hopefully we can get another backstab. The knife does do the most damage. This poor troll has got to be sick of this pesky little human who keeps coming in here and stabbing him in the butt. All right, we should be able to finish him next time we go in. My goodness. All right, let's finish this. Got him, we got him. Yeah, 100 damage, wow, yeah. Man, and this one was swinging around everything. Oh, troll trophy! I got me a troll trophy! Guys! Look at that thing! Yeah, pretty cool. Man, can we build inside the troll cave? I don't want to. I kind of want the troll cave to respawn. That was exciting. Hey. Hey, what is this little burial chamber? This is really cool, actually. Oh, it's another little dungeon! All right, with just the skeletons here, I'm gonna assume, yeah, I'm gonna assume that this is just a normal dungeon. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm gonna assume that's just a normal dungeon. This is turning into meadows again instead of uh, black forest. So we're gonna head this way, try to stay inside the forest here. Another one, oh my gosh, okay, wow. I feel like we had trouble finding them Originally, not really. I guess we have been kind of finding them periodically throughout the videos, which has been good. Oh, another copper deposit. All right. So, yeah, there's copper all throughout these hills. Yeah, we may go back to that spot we picked out earlier. And Oh, someone's attacking me. We better make this quick. Okay. Yeah, going to want to build out there somewhere. We're going to take all of my stuff home real quick. Uh... And then we actually might sail the raft down here. If we can just uh, sail the raft down and park it down there, we may come down here. Uh, oh, another copper deposit. Yeah, so there's plenty of copper out here. We just got to run around and look for it. We should probably be marking copper deposits so we can come back. Is there a way we can do that? Can I dot a copper deposit? Can you change the colors of these little dots? 
I guess we can just erase that later. Yeah. Yeah, we should have been doing this all along, actually, so we could just go back and get them. Oh, that would have been the smart thing to do. Oh my goodness, look at this. Okay. Is this another one? Oh, I was about to get really happy. Oh, this is the clearing. Okay. So yeah, no, this is going to be great. I'm probably going to clear out my, get the get rid of the fog of war here. And then I'm going to head home. And once we get there, then we'll take the raft out for our first sailing trip. I'm actually really excited about that. We'll, uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. I'll see you guys back at the base. That's just going to be me running around. So I'll cut back in when uh, we get back. I'll see you guys back at the base. Ah, home sweet home. All right, so we're going to drop off all our stuff. Reduce our weight down to nothing if we can. And then might go up to the lumber yard up the hill there and, and collect as much wood as we can carry uh, just to bring with us so that when we get out there, we actually have what we need to throw together. Um, to actually throw together a tiny little base out there real quick but uh yeah let me unload everything and gather that wood and we will uh we'll set off on the raft in just a little bit guys oh i thought i caught it so i woke up and a uh, grayling was attacking my base here but uh it's day 43 uh we spent the evening collecting wood a little bit of stone mostly wood we want to be able to build when we get out there so we got enough for a torch and a campfire uh, we got some food on us. So yeah, we're gonna go grab the raft this morning and try to sail down to, uh, our new little, uh, copper location. And hopefully, we can turn that into a really lucrative, quick mining operation, because, uh, uh, running out there back and forth with the copper on the trail is cool and all, but that does not seem to be very... I don't know, that's just, that seems like a lot of time. So we're gonna try and, you know what, we're just gonna, oh, we gotta fix all this stuff too. I guess we were out chopping everything and busy last night. Yeah, let's uh, let's fix some things up. Let's see if we can repair everything. What can we upgrade? Oh wow, we can upgrade the leather helmet. We can upgrade leather stuff. We could upgrade the flint ax. Looks like we could upgrade a few things, guys. Let's try and upgrade. So it looks like we need a lot of this. We're gonna weigh ourselves down and see what we can upgrade real, real quick before we leave. Okay, yeah, what can be upgraded here? Wait, oh, five and five? Oh, guys, troll stuff, troll leather tunic, troll leather pants. Where's that cape? Oh no, oh, the cape costs a lot. Troll leather helmet, oh. Well, we're upgrading the troll stuff before we go. That's super exciting. Can't believe we had enough for all of that. That, That's awesome. Oh, we've never had a cape. Let's go ahead and make ourselves the deer hide cape. Oh, look at all this. This is really cool. All right, what can we upgrade? Definitely the bow. Don't need to upgrade leather pants and stuff. We're not wearing that anymore. Better flint ax, better bow. We're getting rid of all the leather stuff, so none of that needs to be upgraded. Uh, we are going to wear the deer hide cape. Hmm. Hmm. Do we want to? Do we want to? Why not? I don't really know when we're going to run into more uh, trolls. Need more troll leather to upgrade those. And a level four. All right. Well, that was awesome. Cool. So we've got a slight upgrade. Let's... uh. Let's try and put a lot of this stuff back, shall we? Bop, bop, bop. <gasps> Look at us and our blueness. Oh, gosh, I'm so heavy, though. Still. Oh, and we have a cape now, too. We kind of look a little shabby. I'm not going to lie with that cape, but... Uh, ah, look at us and our awesome blue hoodie. This is really cool, actually. Shirt. Oh wait, pants, shirt, pants, cape, I guess? Yeah, that's fine. Let's we'll start keeping all our food over here with, uh, with this stuff, yeah. All right, we don't need the flint anymore. 
We don't have any more wood anywhere, do we? Only in the big 50 chunks. That's okay. All right, so I think we've got everything we want. Look at our new style. Oh, man. Troll armor. All right. Troll armor, leather cape. I bet we could stand the cold a little bit more. We may have to go and try out uh, and see if we can get up into the mountain in the snowy areas. Although I really don't want to mess with wolves. Ooh. Anyway. Oh, no. This thing looks wrecked. Can I repair it? Okay, we did. We repaired it. Yeah, it was... Man, this thing looked absolutely beat up. Probably beat up by a bunch of the gray dwarves that come this way. Okay, so sailing. Never done this before. Whoa. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Uh, ah, okay. Okay. Look at that dark forest over there. I'm not ready to leave this island yet. Oh man, this is cool. We're going sailing. Wow, it's super slow. That's okay, that's okay. We're gonna get there eventually. Maybe walking back and forth would be faster. Instead of sailing around the island. This is, uh... Yeah, this might be slower. <laughs> yeah, wow, I'm gonna turn back. No. Maybe to get from one island to another island. I mean, obviously, it's the only way, but uh, this is so slow. Honestly, I would like to sail it back, but I don't think the wind is going to let us do it. Eris is... Uh, that's my name, the wind. Eris uh, does not uh, give, like, to, like to cooperate half the time. She is a trickster. Guys, we're gonna set it down right here, if we can. Just gonna plunge it onto the side of the hill here, cause uh, yeah, wow, this is a uh, super slow. <laughs> okay, so that's our island. And this is how far we sailed. And that is extremely slow. Like, I think sprinting with a with a full belly is definitely faster than that. So that's kind of unfortunate. I think the raft will be much more handy for sailing from island to island. Definitely looks like a black forest uh, trees over there we saw while we were sailing. So uh, maybe maybe we'll we'll dive over there eventually. Uh, use the raft to actually cross to a different island because that seems like its purpose sailing it around this island just oh wow that was the slowest yeah that was the slowest thing ever we're not going to do that so instead um what am i running this way for i guess we're going to run back uh well we were going to do i don't know let's go check out the mountain let's go see if we can actually survive the the cold and check out that area up there i wonder what resources the mountain has Ah, can we climb? I can't seem to climb. This is all too steep. Here we go. Yes. Okay, let's see if we uh we still freeze up here. And keep an eye out for wolves. We do not want to mess with that. Yes, we are in the mountain. We are freezing and we're hurting. I guess I could make a torch and try to keep myself warmer that way. That's better. Still going to be freezing? Yep. Ah. <laughs> My goodness. All right, well, I guess that's not happening either. Man, nothing's really going super right today. 
I guess we'll just do a little more exploring uh, and head back to the, the Black Forest in that general direction. We have everything to start building. We do need the dock on that side of the island as much as I'd like to sail somewhere closer um, <laughs> and make it not take so long. We do need to get the raft down to this side of the island and we do need to take off in this direction uh, to get down to the Elder, so. We are, I think, going to loop back around. Yeah. Man, how cool is this place? So we're gonna loop loop back around this way. I guess we'll explore a little bit more of the Dark Forest on the way. But yeah, we may meet up with our Dark Forest outpost down here. Maybe try and set up somewhere on this side of the island. Uh, yeah. Okay, so the Black Forest is not very thick out this way on this side of the island. Hey! So that's what tin looks like? Man, that's very small. How, much, how heavy is it? Is it super heavy? Oh. Tin ore is very heavy. All right, so we're gonna drop a little bit of wood. Yeah, okay. Definitely want, uh-oh. Ah, oh, man, I wanna, I wanna carry it home. Guys, I don't wanna drop it. All right, so we're gonna have to drop the wood. Let's just split a stack of wood. Take our loss. That's cool. Tin. Man, it's really small. I hope there's bigger deposits. Oh, look at this. It's already got a nice little spot to come in at. Hmm. Hmm. No. It's nowhere near a. Not really near a dark for or black forest outpost, really. So this is all still meadows that we're finding here. Uh, gonna keep moving on until we find another. Hey, look at that out there. Is that? Nope in a totally different direction. Yeah, we need to keep looping. We're just going to keep moving. We'll come back if something interesting happens. Man, yeah, hauling all of that copper back and forth is going to be really difficult. Um, possibly worth it, but uh, I don't know. Either way, we do need a small little... Whoa. More troll. Hey, we can level up our troll stuff. We can kill him. Shall we give it a try? That did a good bit of damage. Oh! <gasps> oh man, that was a close one. Yeah! Oh my gosh, he can destroy... I can't get my stamina back. No! He destroyed the rock we were standing on and I couldn't get out. Oh my goodness. I didn't expect that. He did, he created a perfect little hole and trapped me. Crap, guys. Well, that was an embarrassing death and we have such a long run ahead of us. Ah, uh, we may take the raft out there. Oh, yeah. This is going to take a while. Oh, look, day 44. Did you all see that? It said day 44. We're on day 44, and we have sailed maybe, I don't know, look at that. That's where we started, right there, that, that island, that little tip right there. That's, oh, boy. Yeah, we have a long way to go. We'll cut back in in a little while when I get down there. I can't. I can't do it, you guys. This thing is so slow. We're just going to leave it here. Definitely faster to just sprint out there, even with our shitty stamina. Um, I'll just build a new raft. You know, I think it'll be faster and simpler to just build a new one out there when we get there. Hey, big guy. Troublemaker? 
All right, we're gonna need our stamina to run in and run out. Cause our body's gotta be around right here somewhere. Hi, Biggin. Yes. Yeah, look at the hole. He did, he trapped us bad. That's mean. You're a meanie, you great big meanie. Don't care about you gray dwarves. One troll boy gone. Ah! Stamina, come on, stamina. Don't fail me now, come on, stamina. Wow, all right, we did it. Goodness. Yeah, all right, we've thought it over, and I guess it makes the most sense to just set up a new a new base out here. And it's, it's not gonna be our main big base, uh, but we are gonna make it a pretty survivable outpost, much like the Hermitage. So we are gonna spend some time on it, we'll build it up, we'll make it nice. Uh, yeah, we're gonna turn it into something really cool and homey to live in, because we may just uh, we may just come out here. I am very tempted to uh, kind of just try to take over one of these huts, because uh, I really like this one. Honestly, look at the the house. It's a little it's a little different than some of just the normal tower turrets that we've been finding. It's close to the water, uh, so I could very easily make a dock down there. Actually, I think we are. You know, let's start. Let's stop second guessing and. And mumble into ourselves, and let's uh, let's commit. Let's uh, let's try and fix this place up. Uh, you know, we can't make stone stuff yet, but it seems to be some of the only stuff that can really defend against the gray dwarves. So I think if we get this place pretty well defended, uh, I think we can make a pretty good little go of it here and make a nice little home for ourselves. So I'm gonna do this. Uh, that's been a pretty kind of an uneventful day, guys, and I'm really sorry about that. But you know how these survival games go. Some days you got a lot to do. And some days you just got a lot of preparation to do. So this is another one of those preparation days. I'm feeling really good. Um, if we can get a copper knife. Oh, sorry. The hiccups are back. Uh, uh, um, if we can get a copper knife, then we can maybe even get a better shield at that point and set sail to go and maybe find the elder eventually. So we're going to you know, look at our island. It's finally, it's finally been explored pretty good. Um, <laughs> we have lots of copper and stuff to go mine and everything, so... Oh man, all that copper is way out there. But that's okay, I really like this spot with this little house. Um, I think we're gonna do it. I think we're gonna set up here, so... Yeah, we'll try and throw something together here, and... You know, we'll let the montage roll. The montage might finish out the video today. We'll, uh... And we'll see how much footage I have, because, uh... This is... Yeah, it's been pretty uneventful, but... Next time, we'll set sail. We'll have a cool base. Hopefully we'll be able to make some more things because I'm just going to get the smelter and the... Oh, you know what we could do real quick? We could go and find another couple of circling coils because that is going to be necessary if we want to come back and live here. So maybe we'll cut in a dungeon exploration thing to finish up the video. But guys, I'm going to come back here and make this a new outpost. So next time we'll see you when this is all finished. And yeah, we'll... uh. I guess we'll go cut to a dungeon run because we're going to need at the very least two more circling coils to set up a nice little smithing outpost out here. So, yeah, we'll see you guys at a dungeon. There's a couple we found, so let's go pick one. Oh, yeah, here's one we stumbled upon earlier. Go away, Grey Dwarf. We're going in here looking for circling cores. Do they know I'm sneaking if I have a torch out? <laughs> All right, we're going to lose the torch. Hey. We found what we needed. Two of them. That's all we needed. I think that'll give us the ten that we need to uh, set up out here in the dark forest. Awesome. Might as well explore the rest of the dungeon while we're here. Hey, cool. Yeah, because we can't ever have too many of these things. So let's keep looking around. Is there one more door? There's one more door. What the hell? I don't like this. I don't like that. A ghost. Uh, that's really creepy. I don't like that. And of course, he's going to stay alerted. All right, let's fight him out here. You know, we're just gonna go at him. I don't know that we can block his attacks, so we're just gonna keep attacking ourselves. 
And yes, we did it. A ghost. Oh, creepy. That was cool. Oh, and he was protecting stuff back here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Good stuff. Awesome. All right. So that gives us a total of six. So I think we... We have about a total of about 14, I think. That's pretty good. And, yeah, like, you know, we're going to move out here to the forest. So if we need more, we'll definitely be nearby uh, plenty more of these little dungeons. Yeah, we need to move out here. I, I love the original Hermitage. I really do. But it's time to move out here, be closer to the resources. Uh, this may turn into our next main base. And then as soon as we get enough copper and tin and stuff mined up and we feel brave and tough, we may sail out. To see what we can find out there uh, near the Elder and what's going on out there. So, yeah, let me get some rest tonight. And let's see, are we going to have a dream? Okay, so no dream, but that's no dream, but that's okay. Day 45. Well, guys, we very well may just call it right here. Time to set up down here, get a nice dock going so we can sail out and eventually go and visit the Elder way down there. So yeah, this may potentially be the site of our new main base. Uh, I'm going to start building here. We're going to set up a new smelter and a new charcoal can and a forge and everything. We're going to turn this into a completely functional, livable, aesthetic, lovable base. And we're going to build a nice little trail leading down to some kind of dock and build a new raft out there but we're gonna do that all off camera so sorry if the episode was a little dry today guys but i still hope you enjoyed yourselves and i thank you so much for hanging out with me go ahead smash that like button if you did enjoy it it helps me out a lot and uh yeah we'll see you next time when we've built this place up uh somebody think of a name for it yeah this little half-assed rock cottage because you know it's gonna be piecemeal of rock and wood we're not gonna be able to build rock ourselves so it's going to be a fun little build. I hope you guys like it, and I'll show it off when we get back next time. Have a good one, guys. Thanks for watching.